In this video, I will provide you with the steepest stairway angle you can possibly use on a variety of different types of construction. However, you will need to check with your local building department to figure out which one of these will work in your area. So let's go ahead and get started with the most common angle, and this is probably going to be the one that fits into the category you're looking for, for residential construction. And it can be found in the 2021 International Residential Building Code book and can be used in most homes, even for your decks, along with outdoor landscaping projects. And that angle is going to be 37.8 degrees, and have a minimum tread or step depth of 10 inches and a maximum riser height of seven and three quarter inches. And this building code here is from the International Building Code Book, not the Residential Building Code Book, and has a seven inch maximum riser, four inch minimum riser height, along with an 11 inch minimum stair tread depth measurement, bringing us to a 32.5 degree angle, and this stairway is probably going to be used for public, commercial, industrial, large apartment buildings, or buildings with more than 50 occupants. Now here's another building code you're going to need to familiarize yourself with, and it will have the same 37.8 degree angle as our first example, because we're still going to have a 7 and 3 quarter inch riser height and a 10 inch tread depth. The only difference here is that we're going to have a one inch nosing or tread overhang. And this is a newer building code requirement. I don't remember it being in the older building code books and one that might create a problem for our first example for residential construction. And in my opinion, it makes sense because it provides us with a larger surface area to put your feet on while walking up the stairs. However, when you're walking down the stairs, it might not have the same feeling. And again, don't forget, I'm providing you with the maximum angle here. You can reduce the height of the riser and increase the depth of the stair tread to lower the angle if you need to. Another one that might work for some of your projects, and I've seen these building codes in a variety of different states, and it will have a 9 inch minimum tread depth and an 8 inch maximum riser height, providing us with a 41.6 degree angle. And I do not recommend building a stairway like this if you can avoid it. As a matter of fact, I only built one of these once, and that was going up to an attic storage area. And of course, to make that stairway a little safer, you can always add an inch nosing, and I would highly recommend that if you could. And of course, this angle here will be exactly the same as the other angle, because by adding the nosing, we don't change the angle of the stairway. And let's go ahead and wrap the video up by providing you with a comfortable step that should work for almost every stairway. And that would be this one here with a maximum riser height of 7 inches and a minimum tread depth of 11 inches. Especially for anyone who doesn't have any building codes to follow in their areas or isn't going to bother checking with their local building department. Otherwise, check with your local building department, find out what the maximum riser height is, find out what the minimum tread depth is, or head over to our other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to stair building to get a little more information about the more common building codes used in the construction industry today.